Greetings everyone, hello and welcome back to Anno 2070 to, yeah, Tor's Island, or one of Tor's Islands that he's got, actually with a, with a thriving city on it. And I've got my eyes on this island here since the last episode, since we've already taken over the big island up here from Tor, with shares primarily. Uh, this time around, yeah, we're already having share majority here again as well. With this one here, it's actually rather easy, right, because... Uh, Thor is actually fighting on two fronts here. He continues to purchase back the shares of this island here. Um, right now, Tori just purchased back once more, so she's got the majority. So he absolutely needs to take one of those shares or he loses this island here too to Tori. On the other hand, we're using this weakness that he's under pressure by two factions um, by also doing the same thing, basically, and right. taking over shares. Right. He cannot win this, right? Because he's also depending on that 10 minutes co uh, cooldown. So as long as Tori purchases shares up here, we also have actually an easy time doing this this would cost me 88,000 credits right now something we can easily do and with that he would lose this island here once more however there is one big problem the moment i take it over this island is lost to us again because it's very close to Quito and Quito There's and I, we are not Situation on the best terms right enough. now. We have the shipping agreement going, but it's it's not helping us for depots, right? He actually has a civil defense with us, so Thor will not take back the island for another 40 minutes. This is great, so this is a, a positive thing. Unfortunately, yeah. Quito was destroyed, we lose the island and Thor could settle on it again. So in this case, I need to wait for that civil defense pack to be available again in 5 minutes and then we will be able to take over this island here for good. I don't care about now, it. we might lose that chair again, but I can purchase it back once more. And I'm pretty confident that we can actually take it over because he has to decide now, Tori or me. And yeah, 50 50 that we take it over now or a bit later. I don't care really. In the meantime, first of all, yeah, there's lots of ships again getting over here. So let's just disperse them. Go, you buggers. Let's move my ships back. We are back here now in Omnitron. This is a really cool name, by the way. And over here, we got those three okay, yeah, mining sites, Destroy. right? And I would like to use them. We have the materials, basically. A bit more electricity I might need to push here, right? So we're going with one excavator. I'm always clicking on the wrong one. Um, I'm going to go with one excavator here. And then we can also go with one power plant, right? This button to provide the electricity. And then, yeah, then we can actually go ahead and get me those uranium mines on the way. And I'm really just going for uranium mines. There is no other way of doing this. So one and two. And for that last one, we actually need a few more materials. Right? But that's not a big deal. Because we can always send just a chip over there with some basic materials, like some building modules that we need. And probably also some tools. Warning. Fire discovered. Yeah, that might be alright. Ready, let's just see. Ah, yeah, she would share it actually. And we have lost the majority here. No, actually, no. My right, Tori continues to purchase the shares here. So this means that we could be good. Be golden. We can actually take over a share now. Let's do this. But with that, we got all four shares now. So even if he purchases back a share, we will be able to take over this island now. There's no way around that anymore. This will belong to us. Just waiting for that civil pact now. And then we can do this. All right. However, of course, as Thor gets weaker, we still need to uh, destroy Keto. For that, we need to get uranium and everything that we have up here. So that uh, compass ship, <laughs> compass 2, already on its way now. We can unload those goods, get the back home again, and build me that last fine. This is... Great, let's just check it out. Yeah, unfortunately, there's really no other mining site. Those three will have to do for now. Let's actually increase the storage of this island here so I can store more goods. Um, we should be able to go for 25 tons we have on at the moment. I can go up to 85. Alert. And Enemy attack on I mean, yeah, buildings. that's probably it. All fires extinguished. And then we get the uranium over once we have more of it. Here we got 28 uranium and some explosives again that we are producing. But this one can continue now again normally with the explosives, right? But we get the uranium on the other island. Don't forget, we will need around three um, long-range missiles because every one of them is not doing enough damage. Actually, take down the whole 20,000 hit points there. So I'm going with three hits at once and my ships move in at the same time trying to then completely destroy it right this is the only way that i can think about it um those ships are too many too powerful and they repair each, each other all the time so quickly but this is not really an option let's get rid of those materials again 
and there's also a quest transport delivery to my minimap location. Ooh, yeah, of course we can. We can try it, but it's to four locations. First location, as far as I can see. Oh, <laughs> yeah, nice try. Seriously, uh, not even in my dreams can I fathom to do this. Let's also quickly check out my 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 consumer goods. And one of them, oh, fifteen thousand. How to continue with Hector? That's actually a, a nice. Right? This really is a cheap, uh, cheap amount, and we can keep him away from us for the for people's future. Look at that! We got 150 heavy weapons right now. That would be great for selling. Uh, explosives, uranium is coming in. We have now again luxury meals, so this is at least stable. We got the burgers and the plastic stable, and the liquor and the fish is stable. Fish, of course, is having its trouble here with those destroyed docks all the time. Um, and once again, I'm not going to build up a big defense here because it's way cheaper to just build those cheap port authorities for the fish than building a massive defense up here that we would need. That would just cost me way too much as every one of these cost me 50 on the maintenance cost. And with that, I would not have enough money for the takeover. Note, so I definitely want to definitely want to go ahead here and, and... Oh, look at Thor. He's trying there. I was looking there, Kito. Civil there defense for 24 very, minutes. Very at, uh, for 60 minutes, let's go up. A mistake. And with that, certain. he will not attack my my buildings now. Um, and with Thor, we also have it at 34 minutes. So when Get is that cooldown running out? In five minutes, we'll be able to take this island for good. In the meantime, let's actually build me another freighter. Ah, we don't have enough limits here. Have to. I don't want to use the big one here. Uh, this island is secure now, by the way, for uh, for some time because. Neither Thor nor Keto would uh, attack that. So let's actually go in and make this one. That's the one. That's the better one. This one we eat. Yeah, this one we eat. And this one here takes Helios, Omnitron, and then Maynard, right? So it takes the, the sugar, the grapes, and the ore that we can then have. So this is going to be a bit of a more complex production here. Grapes. Then we have the ore. In Maynard, and it's going to pick up uranium. <laughs> there it is in Omnitron and delivers that to Maynard. And of course, my one and only there is Raid Rod. And hmm, unfortunately, I don't have any white flag. Now it would be the be right afraid. moment for it. Now would be the moment to actually find me something that enables immunity sorry, on those ships. I'm I can't tell you exactly what we're working on here. Unfortunately, I'm not able to find those items even with a bunch of re-rolling, so unfortunately my ships will stay yeah, prone to attacks online. for the foreseeable future. Uh, there's also no politics that I can. Lots of plastics there again, the explosives are coming in, and that other ship. And boy, this island here, Helios must be happy that there's a ship docking once more. Anyway, he purchased back a share. It doesn't matter. We can still take over the island here. 88,000. And there you go. Attack. Oh, and with that, we also get an achievement here. Settle on islands. <laughs> that was a peaceful settlement, right? District 8 belongs to us now. No one is able to destroy this warehouse here for the foreseeable future. And with that, Thor loses yet another city and probably his main island. Because on the other ones, I cannot see any city. Right, so this was probably his island with... The most for the highest population. This is a major blow. Thanks for for leaving all the streets behind. <laughs> I don't know what what I'm going to do with that, but we'll just see. Uh, unfortunately, you cannot salvage items or anything out of this island like in NO1800, so we just have to be happy with that. I don't care right. about any of this. Still having this one here, mm, civil defense. Then we could actually go for another round right away, or perhaps he goes with a ceasefire now that he's so weak. And yeah, Kito have that activate. Another very Your important thing is we can now have the offshore defense, and this one allows us to attack then submarines, right? So it will make it easier then for us. Let's just check, get rid of those two there, probably. I don't think we are going to need more than two or something like that. Now the problem is we would need to go underwater, and unfortunately, there's no slots for this harbor here. We would have it available, right? So unfortunately, um, I will need to build more Vipers again. All right, it's time. We can build the first missile launch pad and we should do it. And let's have the first one, well, probably somewhere here. We definitely want to 
stretch them around the city, scatter them, right? So not going to build all of them here in this one area. Now we've built it, right? So that's just the missile launch pad though, right? Or the silo. Um, before we can launch a, a missile, we actually need to build one. And for this, we need 40,000 per missile, 50 kerosene, 100 explosives, and 100 uranium. That's a 300 uranium, 300 explosives, 150 kerosene. This should be something that we have already. Yeah, we have. The kerosene is actually finished, right? Explosives, we have 120, and uranium, we don't even have 100 yet. So this nah, is a bit tricky overall, but we should be getting there. And look at that, Thor is actually attacking in a bit of a bigger force here at the moment. Right, so he's got lots of ships there. The problem is we always need to navigate out again, otherwise Kito will actually chase us. And yeah, he's right now building up blockades uh, to my islands. They're very interesting. I, of course, would like to use some of my money, even though it's getting a bit problematic with the money now. Right, so either we stop with it or I try to achieve everything that is the the missiles and also share take over so let's actually continue this is actually cheap island right it's only got 8,000 per share and Tori how are you looking there yeah she's 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 getting all the shares keeping up the pressure there registering conclusion of peace between neighbors you or me that is a lot of the showdown warning Production halted. This one over there. Uh, I've lost a few, but we could actually go with... Let's Registering go with the Colossus. Hmm. Nah. The Colossus. Let's actually continue with the normal commander ships. Energy supply. They're Energy. really my favorite ones. At some point, the piece had to end, so we are losing those uh, islands again. Doesn't matter though, really. Trade buildings destroyed by enemy. I've increased the range of my silence as we are taking over and yet another <laughs> island of him. Now I can continue my work in peace. Signing over of island. Registering improvement in eco balance. All right, we do need to make some money, so selling some of those heavy weapons for 26,000 is absolutely valid. This is actually almost a full island. <laughs> I mean, we're going to lose probably this ship here. As it will most likely be Morning. not able to get Production back there. Breakdown. So why do we actually have not enough fuel rods right now? I think we lost an island here once more. Yes, the problem here is of course longer. that with Keto we are not on the best terms. So hmm, coal we have, right? Oh, we should have a lot. Yeah, we have. Let's put some coal generators. Sorry, pals. Not the biggest fan of coal. But if it's for the survival of my city, we'll just have to go for it. That's over here. And Thor, as always, is continuing to just send his ships there. But it's not as many anymore as before, right? I'm also in the process of taking of this. over this island here. I'm trying it at least. But uh, that would be then... Then he would actually be down to two islands only. So this would be fun indeed. We all just trying to survive, so talk already. Just deduct it from you. And after a bit of while, we have everything ready for this island takeover once more. And this means that... Oh yeah, also we can't build any more launch pads for another 30 minutes. That is actually okay, because I'm not intending to do this anyway. And with that, yeah, Thor lost yet another island. He's down to two islands now. And in that case, he most likely will not... I'll be able to recover from this even though i don't care um the weakness is the important thing because it gives me a bit of room to breathe we have some active trade rods again and i probably will also be able then to use this one up here again i'm not relying too much then on his um trees that are with us but rather the civil defense this is going to be great because then we actually have full trading control again for another full hour and that will be probably the last time that we need to do this because yeah i'm on my way to finish those rockets right we have 200 tons of uranium almost in 300 tons of explosives this is completed right and yeah the money the money is actually the biggest problem then but we can actually sell heavy weapons as well oh, yeah. it's just key to really right now it is annoying me um yeah of Activate course city weapons. development is out of the question for me for now because we have enough people anyway we have the right balance it's all about Morning. trading those Production goods breaking. let's get that ship over here again we're going to build me that well, as again, I think we do have yeah, 25 tons there of uranium Trade sitting around again. This area is a bit of more of a problem there. 
So up here, right? Yeah, I cannot keep this active right now. Civil here. defense, there it is. No 24,000 once fine. more. My men are always glad. And now we have Hello. actually a bit of time Registering attack to do all of this, vehicles. right? So we have this trade rod here that I can activate now. Again, the uranium trade rod, which is already waiting quite a bit. And then we also have this one here. I think I don't have. I mean, I could go with a command ship there. No, you know what? They're actually targets. So let's use a normal freighter and get this one then for that area there. Thor really is not coming around that much anymore. He's sending one ship over there that we can quickly take care of. But that's about it, right? Can Getting this fine? back Thank again you. would be fine. Really got no presence there anymore. That's the That's the great thing, really. Right, next ship is ready, so we can activate this trade rod here also. The monsoon, off it goes. Full trading enabled once more. And let's just keep this going for a while. Right, also what we can see here is the contract with Thor is over the civil defense. And do you hear that? Yeah, that's... That's quite a quiet, isn't that? There is no big attack coming in right now. Thor has a couple of... There must be something here, I guess. And yeah, there's actually a chopper. And Thor also has some, um, well, choppers you over survive, here. But that's about it, it, right? And he's just standing around still. So I think we have officially broke him. For the moment, at least. He's Corny. still too shocked what happened to his world. I don't care about any of this. <laughs> uh, his main island now is also completely in the hands of Tori. He's still not taking over. Um, I don't know why she's not doing it. She could do it at this point. And he's got this tiny island there. But as you also can see, he's got no population anymore, right? So there's no cities here we have. Or he's got no income anymore at that. Um, so that's probably why he's also not building up any more ships. This gives me plenty of time now to really focus on Keto. And of course, my missiles that we definitely want to get ahead of here. There's, there's a, a quest, um, a seize one ship for some crude oil. I'm not doing this. I don't need to do this so we can actually just abandon this. Myself. We also have, I think, destroy the anaconda here still in the mission. And we also need to maintain no missile launch pads for Tori at the moment. I've actually deleted my missile pad right here. The thing is, she would have declared war on us and she's actually really powerful. And I don't want to have another, um, nice yeah, another enemy there all of a sudden that, yeah, I don't really need to have as an enemy. So we just keep that going Receiving for a while and just really focus a, a bit on my economy there. Because this is something we have been neglecting now. I mean, neglecting. I do have strong economy, right? And it's 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 going well right now. We have good goods coming in. Uh, the champagne, what I can see, might be in for a push. So we have the, the champagne sellers somewhere over here. They require grapes and sugar. And in this case here, we actually have both of them in. I'm going to go with another um, another champagne distillery right over here. And we will then just go ahead here and deliver some more resources. So what I can see though is, yeah, we are full on grapes and sugar. I think actually my trade rod is not working once more. It's activated, but there's no ship for it. So yeah, Sea Dream, Commander ship. Uh, I do have my I do have my container ship actually. This is nothing for a container though. So I'm going to take actually probably Merlin that is on the other one. Yeah, let's take Mer. Oh, he's also Merlin is also quite full, and I I, know I need to build one sh uh, ship, right? It's just I'm not going to use my big uh, cargo here for yeah for basically. Oh, ah, she's purchasing a ship here. I'm not going to use my big ship there for a small trade route. So we're going to use the big one here to sell some stuff to French Code, who is in the area right now. We can actually sell some heavy weapons there again. We're producing them anyway. I do have lots of steel, so let's just sell a bunch of steel. I think we have lots of weapons there. Let's also sell a bunch of these. Mm, iron is actually full. I mean, not that we really need that much. A bit of kerosene, perhaps. Let's get this over there. And there is already the new ship. Uh, Serena, let's go in. And you're starting this trade route here as well. Off it goes, already getting me the grape and sugar over. Both of them we're going to need, of course. Iron, by the way, is also on this trade route, right? Yeah, iron is also for it, of course. So, my big one over there. Perfect. Go ahead. Yeah, it's actually not bad. 25,000 we're getting out of this. Of right, so that, was a, that was a nice trade. Sure. Get my ship back home again. 
I actually know what I'm using my big ship for now. So Merlin is going to stop with the trading now. Alright, so we're just going to unload the rest then uh, by ourselves. Because fuel rods are not being transported over. Look at that. There's way more goods, right? So Merlin, of course, cannot take this. So it's going to be now my sea drain. Alright, so finally we have it again. Um, it was destroyed. And since those are rather expensive, I'm not too keen on replacing them again and again. So now that the, the waters are safe again, this can actually go out there and yeah, deliver me all those resources. There's probably going to be quite a bit here now. Yes, look at that. Also some 60 tons of coal. Fantastic. We're also in the process. We can actually improve now our eco balance to positive again. So in this case here, we do have the deacidification. And yeah, we still have space for it. So over here we do have a nice radius. We can build it. It will cost me some electricity. And with that we get a positive eco balance out again. Which of course is boosting the effectiveness of all my farms on this on this island here of Ida. With that we are positive actually. Which yeah, is great for everyone. It will reduce the disasters, Warning. also hopefully the nuclear Reduction disasters. Halted. And it will make people a bit more happy, thus they pay a tiny bit. There's also something new interesting here that we have. So this major island up here, of course, has lots of resources, right? We have gold on it, uh, quite a lot of that too. And as far as I can see, we have lots of mining. Uh, in fact, it is, I think, the same island that we have right now. Uh, there is some new uh, features here as well, but it looks pretty similar, right? We also got those uh, mining sites here. Let's actually get over there. Um, I just don't know who else to turn to. Three crates of lots of mining. Come on, what is up with those crappy missions there? Uh, let's go ahead and build me another viper so we get enough building materials in one go. And with this, we'll be able then, yeah, to yeah expand our economy. I would really like to do this, that we push towards the, the, the jewelry production, right? Which is a new life standard for the executives. So that means also money, of course, down the road. Also, since we have now another stable income, uh, I can actually go ahead and, yeah, probably upgrade a few more people. Look at that. Lobster is out. Do we have more lobster here? I think we might be out of lobster. Ah, this one's actually not in use right now. It was destroyed. There we have a new lobster plantation, but that's about it, right? And with that, I will need to find something new wherever we might have lobster. And funnily enough, no of my islands, none of my islands actually has lobster right now. That's bad luck. <laughs> but in that case, this actually should work anyway since we have another lobster. And they produce quite a lot of it too, right? So volume is rather high. Truffles is high. So I might actually push another luxury production somewhere in here. Hmm. Where we might squeeze it in. Actually, pretty far away from that, that depot over here. And there is also your ship. Get some building materials on board. We have lots of them. By the way, I can actually activate my building module production again. I've deactivated it to save some energy in the energy crisis. Um, and now it's actually back on track again. So also some weapons again. And to fine, actually. Yeah, let's activate that tool manufacturing. Well, get some building materials plus the tools plus some concrete. Plus some steel over there. We have a warehouse here. Yeah, we have a depot still. All right, so we secured that island with this. Oh, look at that. Thor is attacking. Alert. Enemy attack on one of your buildings. Actually take down one of these choppers there. Your lucky streak before Kito come comes back. End. Warning. Vehicle under attack. Alright, that's interesting. He's actually not hibernating yet. Okay, let's get my ships back. Is so Kito on your passes out. Oh, and silence. how's it looking there with her? Civil defense another Anyone six minutes. Then things get a bit, a bit unstable again. And so it is. The mission is gone. We are free to build the missile pads again. And we're going to do this in the next episode. And probably we're then going all out on the attack on Kito. Stay tuned!